Ay, trapper through the night and I can't sleep. Mm. Niggas run up on me, get the gas beat. Yo, oh, the nigga lit like that's me. I'm a bad Hello, welcome back to another episode of Groovy Shack. Now, before I start this video, I want to say that this episode is sponsored by Squarespace. <laughs> Jokes, it's not. Ha, I'm just fucking around, honestly. I'm, I'm so fucking weird. Um, but you know how, like, photographers, like, when they have. Like that one video, they're always like sponsored by Squarespace at first before they start the video. Yeah, no, I'm just taking the piss, man. I'm just taking the piss. Okay, so I went into Sydney to do a little photo shoot with a musician called Lakin. Now, if you don't know who he is, he is a musician. Like I said, we met through from one of his concerts and then we just like kept in touch um, on Instagram and then we were just like, you know, messaging each other and shit like that. And then he was down in Sydney. And we said, hey, why not do a little bit of photo shoot before he goes back? And um, yeah, that's what we did. So we decided what well, the initial plan was to go to Luna Park but we didn't know that it was like, I don't know, like something was happening so we didn't know that it was actually like reserved, there was some function going on, I had no idea but I had this thing in my mind that it looked so cool in Luna Park because of like the colour scheme and everything but we got kicked out. I had my camera with me, the guy was just like, hey man, you can't like really take pictures of it unless you have like a pass or something like that. Something along those lines, man, I have no idea. But we saw a lot of photographers going in there trying to, you know, take pictures and shit like that too, but honestly, we all got kicked out. I was, I was a little bit bummed out about that actually, but it didn't matter, we walked around Sydney, took a couple of pictures, it was actually really cool though, like the spots that we were finding, um, there was one spot which was probably like my favourite photos that I, probably like my favourite picture that I took on that day, um, it was like, it was, it was like near a wharf, it was like a little like walkway thing um, along like beside the sea, and we just like taking pictures because like it matches what he was what Lakin was wearing and we had like a little like um, floating thingy that like the lifeguard uses. What what is that called? I don't know what's it called. But anyway, yeah, it's like that floating device thing. And um, yeah, it looked really really cool. That was probably like my favorite picture of the day, like I said. Um, and then after that we just like continued walking around Sydney and um, there was actually a couple spots we wanted to go like um, we wanted to go to the Apple store actually because apparently they had this like cool futuristic like kind of shit happening um, <coughs> I apologize for that I am like low-key coughing don't know from what but yeah no, I'm okay I'm not sick or anything <laughs> But yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, we wanted to go to the Apple Store because they had like some futuristic thing that was um, that they had inside. 
but we didn't have time because like you know obviously we had to catch a flight back to Melbourne um, but we just walked around Sydney and like basically just like chilled with one another time chilling with him um, I've like I said I've spoken to him like after his gig after a concert and like through Instagram and everything like that you know but it's so different when you're like there right next to him and then you in my head I'm always thinking like yo like you're actually famous like people actually know you holy shit and I'm like hanging out with you it's so like it's fucking crazy so yeah, it was heaps like cool and I'm very, very honored, I'm very appreciative that, that he wanted to do like a little shoot with me, he trusted me and everything like that as well. So yeah, I'm really hoping like the pictures um, he liked it as well and I hope he can use it for his, you know, like future um, ad for his music or like album cover or anything. So yeah, it was really like a, an honor to, to shoot with him. and. Or what else did we do? We basically just like walked around Sydney endlessly, you know, like it was just going with the flow really. We didn't have like a specific um, location that we really want to go just because like of um, time and you know he had to go to the airport and obviously catch his flight and um, yeah it was a really really great fun um, day in Sydney. I really need to go out more. I used to do it a lot I used to go travel to Sydney a lot, or just like every, anywhere really, and just like take pictures. But um, I'm just doing that shit. I have, I am just so busy with uni at the moment with like assignments and shit. So I don't really have time, not just yet. But um, yeah, it was like so cool just going up in Sydney for a couple of hours, doing the photo shoot, come back, look at the results, and it was like actually turned out cool. I'm happy with the results that I had. Um, obviously, I wish you know like. We had more time and um, I could obviously do so much more better with it. But yeah, that is it for this episode. Um, thank you for watching. Catch you on the next episode. And I swear, like the whole Squarespace thing, I was just fucking around. Unless Squarespace wanna like sponsor this video, I'm gonna say no. You know.